Derek, I'll kill Jay here. And this is into the civil trigger here. It's interview House of the Dead uh, Overkill. Yeah. Then we get straight into the gameplay. This game might be fun. Yeah. And also, this is a prequel to before the House of the Dead Part 1. Yeah, it is. And there, there is G. There is G. There you go. Let's get some contrary to shit. Let's get some audio to this shit. So, this, this, is, this is a, a co-op game? Yeah, it is a co-op game, actually. Okay. Hey, I said, that was a bit before, or it didn't happen. I said. This is, this is a co-op game, by the way. Let's go. Should I adjust the audio here? Yeah. There's a game player. Shit, man! I think I slept with that bitch! Your piece is working? Yeah, it's working. Cool. There you go, that's a good gameplay here. Oh shit. What do you think of this game, Infamous? It's pretty fun. Yeah, the settings is it's like a classic western type of uh, yeah. shooting. It's a good, it's a good, uh, good shooter. Yeah, it's a I know you get a lot of content before before 2023 starts, sir. But kind of mood there, to upload some shit, shit there. Who knows? This might be a special review there. Yeah. This may be the longest uh, also the, the game of I mean the longest house the game ever. Yeah, the longest house. Yeah, the longest Let's go fight some zombies. Graphics are pretty good in this game. Not the best in the series, but still good. Still good quality there. That yeah. yeah, Grindhouse feels them too. Sega games. This is what Sega was still making games too. Yeah. Not yeah, that fucking Hassan. Not, 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 not Niku, but they're, they're making House of the Dead yeah. shit. Scarlet Dawn should uh, be re released in the PS4. Oh yeah. The PS5. Uh, I don't know. I don't understand why Sega didn't put this game. This new, newer console. 
This game would be perfect for the PS5. Yeah, you should. I think, uh, I think because of VR, PS4, it should be better. This is kind of fun actually playing this shit. Ah, uh, fun with the wall. Shot his head. Shot her head. Reload. Look at this game, if that's pretty good. Yeah, it's pretty good. It's also the longest in, uh, House of the Dead in the series. Longest game. What's your opinions on it so far, thinking the gameplay? Yeah, the gameplay is good. As an arcade on world shooter. Yeah, it's pretty good. Not my favorite, I mean, not my favorite type of House of the Dead, but it's still pretty good. It has replayability. Yeah, it does. <laughs> I came back. Yeah, I, I, I'll be honest with you. I can't stop uh, playing House of the Dead games. Just, just, they have some replayability. Yeah, they have replayability. That's the key thing. Yeah, uh, like <laughs> like games now. Nah, there's no replayability. Oh shit, so I call from the ceiling. Oh look, a fat so. Oh, there's a watch roll there. Yeah. Hey, buddy, why are you so shit at me, buddy? Hi. Yeah, I got points there. Yeah, that's mine. Oh man. Oh, let's see. A fucking head, a rolling head down the stairs. Rocktro will be in this season, by the way. You will be Red Steel 2, so. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'll review something else, Rocktro. Oh, Shaw's let off. Shit, I fucking hate these zombies. Zombie bastards. So, what do you rate this game out of the 10 if this? Not my favorite, but I'll give it 8 out of 10. I give it 8.5 out of 10, it's pretty good. I like the story, it's pretty good. I like, the, I like how it's a prequel, I like the grindhouse feel, everything about it's good. Yeah. I like the, the females, and it's they're still, pretty hot. It still feels like a House of the Dead game. Yeah, it feels like a House of the Dead game, that's what it's supposed to feel like. Alright, peace out.